Well, we're back here. We're still at her today. I just thought I'd show you guys this little uh, water hole that we're trying to cut around. Nothing real major, but things like this definitely are pain in the rear. But you can see there's still water standing in it. Right there. It'd be nice to be able to get more beans, but how much beans you want to get, we risk getting stuck. But you do left tracks there. I left some tracks right there. Left some tracks over there. Probably should just leave these beans on this little knoll, but I'm gonna try to sneak through here and get another swipe. And I'd say that's about enough. This combine is four wheel drive, but I try not to use it. There we go. I'd say that's good. Let me turn around and get square with the world here. But this has kind of been the story of our harvest. Water holes, mud. I'm just glad that for the most part where we've been working at now, there's a bottom to the mud. This little slimy and greasy on top. But once we get this field done here, we'll have over 100 acres combined today. Between the two machines, I think we've got uh, and we've got about a hundred right now, actually. And we got to move about, I think it's about 10 miles or so. And then we got another 50 acres there, then we got to move again. But I'm hoping we can get moved and get that next 50 acres done before, uh, before it gets dark and possibly move. But I guess we'll see. There's a good chance of rain this afternoon. The sun's went away and the clouds are out now but everything's combined and good yet so I guess we'll see what happens you know I don't know I think this is our chance of rain right now it's about 2.32 and I think we're supposed to rain about 3 but I checked the radar and future scan and I didn't see anything so maybe we're uh, maybe it's gonna miss us I guess it wouldn't probably hurt my feelings too bad if it did um, dealt with water and wetness all all year since uh, we got that blizzard in blizzard in uh, April end of April we uh, we've been kind of dealing with the same crap a different day and it'd be nice to just be able to buckle down and get a bunch of work done got hay to put up yet um, got hay to cut yet and it's got a lot of lot of things going on right now we've got calves to wean so hopefully, I guess is what I'm hoping we can just buckle down next week or two and get a bunch of harvest done and kind of go on to things that have been pushed on the wayside. So, all right, well, we'll finish this video up later on today. We'll move up to that other field, hopefully, and and maybe we'll shoot a little bit of footage up in that field and then we'll call it a video. Thanks for watching. Well. All right, guys, we're back. Today, I guess, is the next late afternoon. I don't know what time it is for sure, about four o'clock, I guess. Not real late, but anyhow, it's late afternoon the next day. We got rained out last night. I ended up not getting a video made to finish that one off, so I guess here I am finishing that video. Um, the beans are still doing good. Real happy with them. I think everyone is, and, uh, I guess uh, I appreciate you guys watching. If you guys would watch uh, or comment, rate, and subscribe if you would. We'll uh, finish unloading this combine here and we'll uh, talk to you guys on the flip side.